Welcome to Dishing It. Today, we are making a spicy Thai basil chicken dish. How do you feel about that? I'm excited. I love Thai. I love basil. Yes, let's let's do it. All right, Jared. Uh, chicken. And uh, it I think I'm just going to watch you today because I don't think I have anything to do. Oh, I'm well, gonna... you're going to heat up the rice here. I'm sorry. Well, there, there's some things. You no, that's what? okay. I just, I, we it... have to get this sauce made. Before... Here's the recipe right there. Yeah, before we put the chicken in. All right, so we are going to start with, uh, how about you read the directions to me while I put this okay. uh, together. Step one. All right. We can have lots of fun. All right. <laughs> Name that song, anybody? Anybody? Okay. Whisk together chicken broth, oyster sauce, soy sauce, fish sauce, that sauce, sauce, I can't even say the sauce. Okay, we're doing one third cup of chicken broth, and then how much of the others? One tablespoon, <laughs> one tablespoon oyster sauce. Oyster. I can't talk today. Okay. One tablespoon soy sauce, two teaspoons fish sauce. All right. And one teaspoon white sugar. All right, Jeremy, here. I'll and one teaspoon brown sugar. I've got all these ingredients here. Let me have you give me oh. one tablespoon of the soy sauce. I'm putting in the fish sauce, the oyster sauce, the white sugar and the brown sugar, and one tablespoon of the soy sauce. Wait, how much of the soy did one, I say? One tablespoon. Oh. Yep, that's it. And then we're going to whisk. You know, one thing I did not look, is there, I didn't bring it out here, is there any salt and pepper in any of that? Because I didn't uh, see that. Uh, chicken thighs, shallots, mince, beef, 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 I don't see salt and pepper. Okay, that's, I didn't believe I saw it either. Okay, I'm going to whisk this together. Now, what is, I think we're supposed to put some oil in the pan and Hold get up, that yeah, let me get to that, hard, hold on. Okay, now you're whisking that together. Heat large skillet over high heat. Oh, we don't have it on high. Over high heat, there we go. Uh, Drizzle in oil, right. add chicken, and stir fry until it loses its raw color two to three minutes. Okay, right. so I need to get, drizzle get in. some oil there and then we'll put this in and then I believe that we're gonna put a little bit of this, this mixture in with it here in just a little bit. Perfect. And put our chicken in there. We won't have a sizzle yet probably, but not, not bad. We got a little, these are chicken thighs. Chicken thighs it calls for. Okay, we've got a little sizzle going on there. So the chicken thigh is the darker meat, which I'm going to say they're using because of the flavor, a little bit more fat in that, and the flavor, which I, I like. There we go. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that, then, okay, so yeah. yeah. I'm, trying to, I'm just reading the directions as we go, guys, no, so no, I don't know. This, this, we got to cook for two to three minutes. And then uh, it asks, how much uh, of the sauce are just we Just one to tablespoon of the sauce mixture to the skillet. Okay. So yeah, I noticed uh, that it didn't call for salt and pepper. I guess the fish sauce is a little bit uh, salty, so that's going to be our salt. Well, the good news is I haven't smelled it yet. You well, know how sometimes well, we use fish sauce? Try it and see. Okay, let's see. See if you... No, I don't smell it you in this. You don't? No. Well, we bought fish sauce once, and we used it once. And um, we gave it away. I don't know if... if I you know, know I smell more of this? What? The, the soy. soy sauce, yeah. That's a strong... Okay. I think we're getting there. And there's oh, the beautiful. tablespoon behind you, yeah. Jeremy. If, uh, Once here. that's cooked, we add yeah, this. Yeah, we'll add that. Let me see. Let me just see. And then we've got some rice that we're going to warm up with some butter and a little bit of water and have that with this. I'm going to go ahead and get this prepped. Yeah, do it. With the water and butter. All right. Just prepping it. Just prep it. Just going to prep this a little bit. Don't want it to stick. Nope. That always happens to me. How but, much of this butter? I'm going to put in just, just so whatever you want. A couple tablespoons. The There's no right or wrong. You know, lots of butter is. Can I ask a better. quick question? Is this yeah. butter from the Ziploc bag? Yes. Okay. Guys, we learned our lesson the hard way a few well, weeks ago. If you don't always clean out your fridge, the butter will take on whatever you have in the fridge, the flavors that are not so nice in the fridge. It ruined something what we were working on. It ruined on. our uh, Mountain Dew pancakes. Yes. It did. We're it like, was... this doesn't taste good. Something's wrong. And it was not our pancakes. No. It was just that. I think we're good, Jared, to go ahead and add that one tablespoon. It's good. I still see. What, do we have a rack? Oh, here's a rack. Oh, sorry. Sure. I was looking for a rack. Yeah, I got no butter worries. all over my hands. You got it all over your hands. All right. It's getting there. Okay. Because here, oh, uh, do you add the sauce before we? Because we're going to add the shallots and hold on. Some this. Other oh, things. stir in shallots, garlic, and chilies. Oh, before the sauce. Yes. Okay. All right. So we've got. Uh, the garlic, how much garlic? Uh, the garlic, it is two, four cloves garlic. Sorry, four cloves. Oh, that's a lot. 
So uh, we just What's had the best side two of that? Tablespoons. Let me look at the side of that jar. I can tell you. No, on the lid. Sorry. Oh. It tell that's how we learned. Remember that one time? Yes, I didn't know I've that. I've forgotten already. So it says half a teaspoon is one clove. Okay, so we've got two two cloves here. So I need half a teaspoon right? is one clove, and you need two of those. Yes, then. These are. Need this is tablespoon. Oh. Half that's teaspoon. Okay. Just two. Yeah, that's yeah, probably we're enough. good. That's we're good. We like garlic. I'm not a mathematician. We had a lot of garlic in our Thai. Yes. What was it we had? No, lot? yesterday we made the pesto pasta. Yes. Oh gosh, that was rich. Kelly's garlic. breath, you could see it. <laughs> oh my goodness sakes. All right. Okay, so I now add the shallots it. and right. the sliced chilies, which yeah. that sounds amazing. Shallots are going in and the sliced chilies right here. That's amazing. I love chilies. Get them all in there. There we go. All right. So you add that, and that's an oh, another two to three minutes until it starts to caramelize. You know, when I, I see this kind of thing, I know that they put it in the right, you know, the right amounts. But it's like, look at those shallots. I mean, I, I can go for about three times that many. You know what I'm saying? I no, I hear you. I you smell what, what you're saying? cooking. Yeah, you smell what I'm cooking. I here? do. It's basil Thai chicken. Yeah. And I, I have to say, they have to hopefully know what they're doing. Well, I'm sure they do. I don't. I mean, you know. We're just following the recipe. That's why we always change it, because sometimes we don't agree with people. Well, and that is true. I'll be honest with you, Kel. When I do some DIY projects at home, yeah. when they say mix like one part concrete to two parts water or something, and you say, I say, mm -hmm. no, I know what I'm doing. Yeah. I know the I go off the consistency of the concrete, mm -hmm. not what they say. And I agree with that. When I'm baking, I go off the consistency too, because I know what it's supposed to feel like. Now, I mean, that that is with anything. Like sometimes you ask for directions with a Siri, and you have an idea where something is, mm -hmm. and you know she is way off base. I, it reminds me of the episode of The Office when Michael Scott drives his car into the lake because mm -hmm. Siri told him to. Well, I'm and he was you, listening to Siri. Would he drive to the top of a cliff if Siri told him to and and, and jump off? I yes, mean, Michael Scott would. Okay, Michael no, Scott would. Michael Scott would. Right. I can get a lot of agreement so this from is our the whole audience. Thing. You kind of have a you got to have a little bit of a roadmap before you. So do you want me to add the sauce before the break or after, or after um, the break? All right. Oh, with the break. Wait, okay. right, when we come back, we're going to add the sauce to the chicken. Yeah. More basil Thai chicken. I'm dishing it right after this. Okay.